Hey guys, welcome back. So yes, I have a full face of makeup. I have green lips, but I didn't do my brows. That's because two days ago I saw a picture of a makeup artist called Stella S Makeup. I believe Stella.s.makeup on Instagram. And she did something with her brows that I've never seen before. She calls it feather brows. And um, I think she wants it to be a new trend or she's trying to start a new trend. It is very weird or different. Let's call it different. But I was very intrigued by it. It looks more like an editorial brow, but well, you know, maybe it will be a trend. Let's be honest. Ten years ago, my brows would just look like this. Like I used an eyeliner and look at my brows now. Ten years later, everyone is like, your brows have to be full. They have to be sharp. Blah 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 blah. So you never know. Maybe this will be a new trend. So I really want to try it out. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I do know that she uses a glue stick so I have a glue stick and some disposable mascara ones to brush my eyebrows so let's hope for the best and let's try it out. Okay so I'm just taking a little bit of that glue on this disposable just a little bit. I don't know if this is a little bit, but okay, I'm just, I don't know. Should I divide the lashes first? Is that even possible? By the way, this is a blackhead remover. I was searching for something very thin. Um, so that's why I took this one and no, it is not dirty. I made sure that it's clean. Mm. No, I don't think this will work. I'm just gonna brush them up like so. It feels like I have to like glue them onto my skin. Okay, let's do that. It looks easier than it is. This is not easy. Okay. Stay there. Okay. Let's do these. Wow. to be like more up. Actually hurts a little bit because I really have to push the lashes onto my skin or I have to press them onto my skin and the skin here is very thin so okay I think I got it. it looks so light it's because the skin is peeking through but I haven't applied any eyebrow product on it. So maybe I'm just gonna use like an eyebrow gel with a little bit of color just to make it a little bit more intense because look at my eyebrows, it just looks weird and light. But I also wanna do this side. I don't know if it's gonna work because my hairs are going straight up like here at the beginning part of my eye. But um, I'm gonna try. Let's take a little bit more of that glue. Just okay, that's about it. I can't push them any further. <clears throat> you know what? Let me grab an eyebrow gel and just make the eyebrows a little bit more intense. Just a sec. So I got the Pro Longwear Waterproof Brow Set and then I realized that this one is empty. So I am going to use a brow pencil. This one is Ebony by Anastasia. And I just wanted to like darken the hairs. But I don't want to draw on hair because I want this to be my natural hair. You know what? 
just leave it like that. I don't think I'm supposed to apply product. Well, maybe I should, but it's not working for me because my skin is, well, my, my hairs are so harsh right now. Maybe you should apply it before, but then when you're gonna brush the hairs, it's gonna get everywhere on your skin. And one tip, do not apply your foundation before doing this because my whole area around my eye is crap right now so I'm just gonna leave it like that what do you think those are some wild brows but so yeah this is what it looks like I think it's very cool I really like it I have to get used to the color because um, I didn't apply any brow product on it and um, you can see the skin peeking through so I yeah maybe it's because my hair is dark and I have eyeliner on and that's why the contrast is so big right now. And normally I have pretty dark eyebrows, but this is pretty cool. Maybe it will be a new trend. Who knows? Let's do the other side real quick and let's see how this will look with two eyebrows. I don't know. Is it weird if I say that I actually like it? It is maybe more of a out of the box brow and i don't know if i would wear this on a daily basis but i think it's pretty cool and i know a lot of you will say oh it's ugly um this is not the way to do your brows no this is not the way we do our brows but it's something new and something new doesn't necessarily mean something negative uh maybe it's just something you gotta get used to but I don't know. Anyway, I just wanted to do uh, these brows. I just want to check it out how it would look. I wish my brows were a bit darker. Maybe I should have applied a dip brow before, but I didn't want to have the like the brow dip or uh, eyeshadow or whatever on my skin because you really have to push with the uh, uh, mascara disposable to make the eyebrows hair stick onto your face and again do not apply foundation before doing this because around here there is no foundation left so yeah that's it i hope you guys enjoy watching this video if you think i should do my brows more often like this or just keep it to my normal brow routine then please uh, let me know and thank you for watching bye bye